Michael brought it in two weeks ago. Oh, Every time we travel to the to Europe and to the big food shows, I've never been impressed with this cheese. So now you're going to serve it to us? I want you to tell me if you think it's something phenomenal because I don't. Mm. So, so we brought it in. We brought a whole wheel of it in. So in Colin sent in and he's bought it. But I don't want to keep carrying it. I'll let y'all say, hey, Michael, I love this shit and I'm going to come up with it. <laughs> it's called Lecaster and it's, it's very reminiscent of a cheddar. It, the, Back in, it's, a, it's a very, very old recipe, and it used to be called white, because in the war times, this was a very inexpensive cheese, and everybody ate it. But then when they recreated the recipe, they added the food coloring to it. So now you've got a natto vegetable food coloring, which makes it this bright orange for marketing reasons, but they also wanted to differentiate now that it's a higher end, higher quality cheese. So. After we serve this, I want y'all to say, Michael, I would drive up here for this cheese. <laughs> and we'll, we'll keep carrying it. Pairing-wise, though, we're going to pair with an IPA beer jelly, because cheddars really, really go well with beer. So we thought this would be a great pairing for the second round. We're going to stay with the same wine, but we need to change our men. Okay, we'll stay with the same wine. 